Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hope you all are having a wonderful Monday morning. We're getting started with this video today. It's called The List. There are a few names that I have left off that I didn't know or that I have forgotten to put on here. The rest of them are on here with pictures. There are a few at the end who have unhonorable mentions. And if you all know of any that I have forgotten, please add them in the description box below because we're going to be discussing them on Thursdays live. Um, I would just like to go through and see if we can eliminate any in our own minds, eliminate any of these people off this list. And it's there's quite a few guys. This is this is unreal. This is really, really a circus. So I hope you all are having a wonderful day. I hope you, whatever you want to call it, enjoy the video. Please share, like, subscribe, and ring the bell, guys. And I hope you keep coming back for more. And for all the new subscribers that I've gotten lately, please, please make yourselves welcome. Make yourselves at home. And this place is for everybody's opinion, their thoughts, their theories, and we just want to make you feel welcome and keep coming back, guys. Okay, on with the list. We have, let's see, Donald Wells, Candace Bly, Candace Herrer, David Dotson, Robin Lane, Jackie Dobbs. Billy Dishner, Fred Hill, Frank Lott, Jody Sue Brown, Andy Bernard, Damian Bernard, Hunter Mullaney, Allie Mullaney Harris, Marlena Crawford, Crystal Spencer, David Britt, Brianna Tester, Andrew Hiltz Hayes, Jose Roman, Dudley Ajan, Donald Sharfy Jr., Donald Wells III, Sonia Sessions, Tim Mullen, and there are a few unhonorable mentions, which is Robert Britt, Daniel Sherfy, who is Sherfy Jr.'s uncle, and Chris Marco. If there are any others that I'm forgetting, folks, please make sure to add them to the description box below because we want to have all the people that are supposed to be on this list in one place so that hopefully we can go through and we can, in our own minds, like I said before, try to start striking some of these people off this list. This is a very huge list of people who are under suspicion on a child's disappearance. Summer Moon Utah Wells, age six now, but she was five, on June the 15th, 2021, disappeared from somewhere. We are not even sure. We can't narrow down even where she was at when she got gone. It was said she was at home. We can't narrow down what time she even got gone. We don't even know for a fact what the date was. It's alleged it was on the 15th of June, 2021. But we don't even know that. We are pretty sure we can say, yes, she got gone in the year 2021. And the fact that she got gone, that's the two things that we know. But I would like your help in trying to mark off some of these names for sure. 
either you say they're guilty and I say they're not, or I say they're guilty and you say they're not. If we have a calm, cool, collected discussion on this, then maybe by reasoning and deduction, we can take some of these names off this list and narrow down the possibilities. I hope you join me on Thursday, guys. This is what we're going to be discussing. This is what we're going to go over on live on Thursday. I hope you all, every one of you, join me. Whether you're moderators, subscribers, viewers, invite your friends. Invite whoever is interested in this case, is interested in missing children's cases. We Maybe we need fresh eyes on this. Maybe they can see something that we don't or that we have went over a thousand times and it's just stuck in our brains and we can't see past it. Please share the video, hit the subscribe button, but make sure and be there on Thursday, guys. I really want everyone that can be there to be there because I want everyone's opinion and their thoughts and their theories about these names. We've got to find some way to knock some of these names off. We've got to figure out what happened to this baby. Don't forget, love your family. Pray for your family. Pray for your neighbors. Pray for this case and all the children involved in it. And folks, please, please say extra prayers for all the families that have lost their loved ones, their homes, their belongings, everything in the floods that have happened over the last few days. And we'll see you on the next video, guys.